In the Palestinian territories, there are those who can't help themselves. And, like a ray of light in the darkness, Anna Friedman is there. Full of cultural and national pride, she works hard each day to make sure these people have a good life. I'm originally from Eugene, Oregon. I went to college in Minnesota. I'm actually still taking classes while I'm doing my internship now. I work for Hamoked, which is the Center for the Defense of the Individual in the Palestinian Territories. Basically, they're an organization that um, upholds international human rights standards for individuals who are uh, living in the Palestinian territories. One of the perks of living at Tikkura Hamish is our in-house laundry. We got it about a week ago. It's fabulous. They enjoy a pretty healthy relationship with the Israeli government and the Israeli military. I am specifically an administrative worker. My other job, which I actually haven't started yet, is um, helping them compile a uh, a list of potential donors um, to their organization. So this is our living room, apartment number one. We're kind of the social hub of Tzipor Hamish. Actually, the paintings on the wall here were done by the fabulous Shira Ballin, who is on the arts track. I think that the Witches program is very unique in that it brings together a group of people who might not otherwise know each other or meet each other. It gives them an opportunity to develop as individuals, as professionals, as Jewish people. We have our Israeli flag and then I brought my Puerto Rican flag. I lived in a predominantly Puerto Rican neighborhood and I have very, very strong Puerto Rican pride. It's been really cool to be a part of the Peace and Social Justice track. It's a, it's a really neat kind of like unifier. And here, it's kind of refreshing to be around people who are very direct. Um, the attitudes of the people, even though they may push you on the street, they'll invite you over for Shabbos dinner. And I really like the food here. Working hard at the African Refugee Development Center are Ellen Munter and Elisa Fishman. The team of workers at the center know what to do to get refugees back on their feet. But don't take my word for it. Listen to them. I'm from San Antonio, Texas. I'm from San Diego, California. We work at the African Refugee Development Center. We work with African refugees from all over Africa, most um, from, from Sudan, Sudan Eritrea, um, Ethiopia, Kenya. We have shelters for women, children, and families. And then we also offer like one-on-one -on -one counseling. And then we're also helping them find the funding to actually go back to school. <laughs> we do anything and everything we're asked. We work in the office a lot of the time, so we do like administrative stuff. Um, we do a lot of um, distributing donations that are made. We're also working on setting up individual tutoring sessions. And this place is primarily volunteer run, so most people aren't paid to come here. And um, so we have like a lot of freedom to get to do like our own projects. Did you call me? No. <laughs> the work environment's super laid back. Everyone's really cool. I think there's like one, maybe two Israelis that work here and the rest mm -hmm. are from America, Canada, England, all over Europe, everywhere. I came here on birth right before it and it wasn't long enough to to actually get a full experience here. So I really like Wood just because it's a program that provides a lot of freedom. You can kind of like pick and choose what you want to take from it. I like that every Tuesday we get to go somewhere new, somewhere we haven't been before and probably wouldn't have gone without Widgets. My favorite par part about being in Israel so far is that I've gotten to meet a lot of family that I didn't know um, lived in Israel, so I've gotten to have like, a lot of family experiences and that's been really great. Uh, just a side note that our office is moving right now, that's why <laughs> everything is everywhere. Having Shabbat. One day a week where you can just relax and be with your friends and be with your family and get to do whatever you want to do. The cats scream all night. The ARV is a really great place and you should volunteer here and donate. Are you ready? I am now. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> I don't want to do this. Can I do it for you? No, you can do it for Her me. name is Ellen Munter. No. <laughs> She's come to Israel because she wants to chew it up. Do you want me to write it on my Word document for you? And you A can script read it? for me to read? <laughs> Say, I came to, I've decided to come on Wedges because
because. Okay. Wait. 